forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. A lot of severe weather on this day back in 1958. We had a squall line race through the area. The worst of the wind damage and the most widespread wind damage is Wyatt, Plasky, Fulton, Cass, Miami, and Howard County. Some of those gusts pushing hurricane force and race through between 1:45 and 3 p.m., dropping our temps from the 80s. To two days later, down to the 30s with some patchy frost. We can get strong fronts this time of year that'll bring patchy frost and severe weather. If you notice our precision tracker now, notice that the high and mid-level clouds are streaming from the west. But look closely here. You see, watch right here. There's a line right there. Notice how it backs to the west. What this is, we had a little front come through this morning. And as high pressure was over Quebec this evening, it kind of reinforced the northeast flow into our area and it kind of combined with a lake breeze front to produce this little cloud band, which is kind of like a little secondary cool front. So all that said, it will turn cooler tonight. We're going to be in the 40s to low 50s. Then eventually this big system to the west heads our way. It will bring periodic showers and storms all of next week. But a nice weekend overall. A few spotty showers and storms Sunday evening after 6 till about maybe 9 then dry until Monday morning and then throughout next week again waves of showers and scattered storms and the rain could add up through all the next week some places are going to end up with three inches of rain total 75 to about 80 tomorrow will do it 77 Lafayette will be in the upper 70s to low 80s on Sunday and for Memorial Day around 80 to the low 80s area wide the all important precision future cast here we go this is early tomorrow morning at 6 you know, a lot of high and mid-level clouds around. That sun will be really dimmed and faded away. So kind of a partly to mostly cloudy sky. But I do think those clouds may thin out tomorrow afternoon. So we may actually increase the sun a little bit for a while during the afternoon. Then partly cloudy tomorrow night. Partly cloudy early on Sunday morning. We go mostly cloudy late Sunday. But I think 6 p.m. onward, a few spotty showers. Perhaps a couple of thunderstorms are possible. Then a break. And then perhaps a few more showers and storms developing towards Monday morning with 82, 83, <coughs> pardon me, on Tuesday, 80 on Wednesday and Thursday, still 82 Friday. And again, several rounds of showers and storms uh, through next week. You want to tune into Amber Hardwick this weekend. She'll have an update on the, any changes, even by an hour with the timing, any scattered showers and storms late Sunday as a lot of people are hanging on on this forecast with a lot of plans and of course the Indy 500 on Sunday too. There's a lot of big events mm -hmm. maybe swinging for the